Most Oklahomans are familiar with the scissor-tailed flycatcher as our state bird and the redbud as our state tree. Fewer are familiar with our state tartan, or the list of some four or five dozen other official thises, thats, and the others, including the bullfrog, our official amphibian, and the watermelon, our official vegetable, not to be confused with our official fruit, the strawberry. And then there's our state song, our state gospel song, our state folk song, and our state country and western song, Faded Love. With every heartbeat I still think of you and remember our faded love. In this sensory overload of all things Oklahoma, it might be easy to miss the small print in Latin on our state seal. Labor omnia vincit, labor conquers all. It's our state motto, and it was adopted 14 years before statehood as the motto of Oklahoma Territory. When the state constitution was adopted in 1907, it specified the inclusion of the motto in the design of the state seal. It is not unique to Oklahoma. The slogan has been used extensively in the labor movement. It appears on the 1886 seal of the American Federation of Labor, and it's still used by the United Brotherhood of Carpenters and Joiners of America. But few know this simple sentiment is in fact a campaign slogan of sorts that's over 2,000 years old. It first appears in the Roman poet Virgil's second major work, The Georgics, a four-volume instructional poem written in support of Augustus Caesar's campaign encouraging his subjects to take up farming. (laughs) 